1 state the following vectors in term of A. So we see here we have A here. So the vector here you see, you can actually make triangle to know what is your X and Y. So we know it's going this way, right? But it's actually we are going positive Y and positive X all together. So the value of X will be positive. The value of Y will be positive. So the vector of A is equal. Two. So this one is 1, 2, 3, 4, 4, i. So usually we use i for the x direction. And then this one is 1, 2, 3, 4, 4 up, which is 4, j. So this is our vector a. So now following vectors in term of alpha. So actually you can use either x or y. Use the ratio, you will still get the same answer. Okay, so this one. If you are going to use X, so now PQ, okay. So, first you see direction. Direction is equal. So, it is positive, okay. So, PQ, the X is 2. So, you compare. So, A to PQ, this one is ratio. So, A is 4 and PQ is 2. Or you can also arrange A over PQ is equal to 4 over 2. So, if you want to get PQ, that's me you change direction with 4 over 2. So, PQ is equal to A divided by 4 over 2 or A divided by 2 or half A. So, we know that here that PQ is equal to half of A. Okay. For x, you see here the, uh, the direction is opposite. Instead it's going this way, it's going this way. So we know that it is negative a. But before that, so we calculate we are using x. If you want to use y, you still get the same answer. So if I use y here, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. I have 6 here. This one is x. So a to x. A. So a is 4 and here x we are taking y of the x is 6 okay so we see here opposite direction so this one is going down and going this way right so opposite direction with this one so it is negative so here a over x is equal to 4 over negative 6 or here when you want to find x we change place so here x is equal to a divided. So 4 divided by negative 6 is actually negative 2 over 3. So when you divide fraction, actually you multiply with opposite. So negative 3 over 2 a. So this one x is equal to negative 3 over 2 a. So here for y, you can see that it is opposite direction again. So you can choose either to take x or y but if you take x compare with x take y compare with y so this one x 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 so i have 7 here okay so i'm going to take my x so comparing the vector of a of x so a to this one is vector y so a for x is 4 and y is 7 so, A divided by Y is equal to, okay, so before this, you see here opposite direction, don't forget to put negative. So, this one is 4 divided by negative 7. Okay, so we wanted to find Y because Y in term of A, right? So, we change place with 4 divided by negative 7. So, here A divided by, so 4 divided by negative 7 is actually negative 7, 4 over 7 is equal to y so y is equal to a so when you divide with fraction actually you are multiplying opposite negative 7 over 4 so here we get negative 7 over 4 a okay so this one is y is equal to negative 7 over 4 a and last one is rs you see here the direction is equal with a okay so you can choose x or y so if I want to take y1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So this one is 5. Okay, so y of a is 4. So a ratio rs, a is 4, rs is actually 5. Right, we are comparing y right now. So a divided by rs is equal to 4 over 5. So we wanted to find rs, we change place. 
So here RS is equal to, so you change place right, so this one is A divided by 4 over 5. So this one when you divide with fraction, actually you are multiplying opposite. So here you get 5 over 4 A. So this one is RS is equal to 5 over 4 A. So this one is the factor.